this out of the way. Ho! Hello everybody, um, welcome to episode 5 of Mum's Got a Broken Ankle. Um, I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do today to be honest, uh, I've got a couple of hours um, and thought I'd squeeze something out. Oh, I also was going to introduce myself because I haven't done that properly, I did one at the end of a video, the third one I think, um, but it wasn't very thorough. Not that this is going to go on for too long, but hello, my name is Louis, or Luis Navidad, as I am sometimes known. Um, I play in a band, I make beats, and I write songs. Um, I've started this YouTube channel purely because um, I do this so much with so many cool people, um, and we often make a lot of good shit that doesn't really find a place to get released um, and we have a lot of fun in the sessions so I thought hey I should just start banging these up once a week on YouTube just a couple of hours um, and I've been really enjoying them so far um, if you haven't seen any of the others do go check them out the first one was really fun with Benj that might be a good uh, one to get stuck in on if this is your first time watching uh, because I'm probably going to be more boring and with the other dudes but hopefully the music's still just as good <laughs> um, um, and yeah normally um, we try and come up with three pretty basic elements like someone doing some chords a drummy bassy thing and a hopefully a vocal and then we try and structure that and we try and keep it under an hour but it always goes over it's more like an hour and 15 um then yeah we always just try and keep the sounds interesting trying to get creative with what we're chucking in here um and genre wise we keep it pretty loose it's all bedroomy dreamy hip hoppy indie alternative-y soulfully stuff um so yeah that's the deal mum's got broken ankle and it's called that because, um, well, 
I was wanting, I really want to do an NTS show in my life. I'm pretty much my whole life. I think I was going to be working up to getting an NTS show and it's going to be called mum's got a broken ankle. I don't know why. I just, um, was listening to it one day. And I was like, that name came to me. It's like, fuck yeah, that's going to be what it's going to be called. So I think this is where it's going to start guys. This is, this is the journey. This is the beginning. Um, but cool. Let's just get on with something and make a tune. I, Oh, could be a bit of a challenge, but I was watching the um, Red Bull Music Academy with Q-Tip, who's one of my all-time faves. I've got a little folder here of beats for Q-Tip, uh, which we won't go to now. But he was saying, or the interviewer was saying, um, how he's always impressed with Q-Tip's use of three-bar loops. I don't know if I, I don't know if we should do that. I mean, I feel like you need to... Do you need to be careful with that kind of stuff? Maybe not. Wait, where is it? Work in progress. Q-tip. Yeah, there you go. Q-tip, you little fucker. Um, cool. Uh, all right. Let's crack on with some drums, I reckon. Um, I've had a few technology problems with these shows so far. The first one is that we get a bit of latency when we're playing bass and keys and stuff, which is quite annoying. Um, but we're going to work around that. We will break on through to the other side. Um, where's my brakes? Go to's brakes. Okay. I've been also trying to think of how Arlo Parks, Gianluca, what's his name? I don't know his full name, but I think the producer's called Gianluca. He's Italian, I know that. Um, he, his drums are just the best. Um, maybe we should start trying to get some Arlo Parksy drums. I feel like... I feel like Arlo Parks is living in here. So we're going to just chop up this, sorry, I need to remember to talk to you guys as well when this goes on, because otherwise it might get a little bit boring just watching a guy on a screen. So I'm just trying to get some variations in a drum loop here. Um, by the way, I'm not sure what this drum loop is. I think it's legal though. I think we're good because it's <laughs> unnamed. I don't worry, no, I have no idea. I'm hoping it's I'm hoping it's gonna be alright. Just get that audio clip. That's that guy, isn't it? Yeah, baby. Cool. Just get that popping away. Uh, I feel like he needs something a little bit more robust in the way of a kick drum. Let's get your fucking kick on, son. Right, so we go replace the double drum track. This is the way I do it. There's lots of ways to do it. Uh, and then you find a kick drum. I'll just whack up. Pull up my um, boom bap kit, which is a little selection of things, which is really nice. If you DM me, I'd I might send it to you because it's good. And you'll be the second person to DM me or email me from the show. Um, the first one was a, uh, a a product review promoter, which is just like not, not fun really, is it? So 
that's the loop. Let's get uh, these velocities feeling a little bit dope. I also might see whilst we're here if I can grab a snare at the same time. So do the same thing. This is probably one of my favourite things about Logic, you know guys. I don't think Ableton has this kind of shit. Not that it's competition and everybody do their thing. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. But this is so, so sweet. This will save you years of your life. At both hands. Um, cool. Let's see what it sounds like if we. I mean, I do like the snare. I think we. I just don't think um, Italian Arlo Parks man would would settle for that. I think it's too. I think it's too hip hoppy. I think we want to go a little bit more indie. Okay, let's drag you bitches out. So we just isolate the snares. Okay. Oh, nice. Good stuff. Cool. I don't think there was too many audio clicks in there. Take fade out. I mean, maybe you want some audio clicks in there. I feel like... Did uh, NPCs have, like, auto fade in and out and stuff? Maybe they did. Maybe they, they probably did. You probably just do it manually, but I'm, I'm sure you could do a fade if you wanted to. Um, what's it called? Cool, that's fine, we can live with that. Hmm, maybe that's not fine. Hmm, no. I think it's because we got a little kick drum in there, you know? Why don't we take him the other way? Ooh, ooh. No, 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 no. Don't be crazy, man. Don't be crazy, you see? Okay, fuck it. I'm just gonna live with it. And if it makes the track sound horrible at the end, sorry. See, uh, I mean, it is. I like the noise. I think we should bring some separate noise in later. Tied together, aren't you, little fuckers? Um,
Okay. Um, we are recording an audio hijack, yeah. All right, let's see. Um, let's get the boom back, kit back up. Full kits. Boom back. He's so noisy. Okay, let's scrap him. Let's look for something else. Oh, I don't think that's Ooh, that that sounds properly Arlo Parksy. Come on. Okay, let's go with that. In the spirit of things, how much time have we spent doing that? 15 minutes, okay. It feels a little bit too long if you're doing that, but that's cool. We go, uh, I feel like we want some claps. Some clippity clippity claps, baby. Um, there they are. Just trying to think, what's where are my organic? Claps at maybe just DJ claps. DJ was a song that we did with family. Um, that, that I don't think we will ever see the life day, which is maybe no, not such a bad thing. Um, there's elements to it which are just amazing, but it's <laughs> it's a hard song to pull off. Is is I think the conclusion. DJ claps. Okay, could we make it feel more crang mini. Alright, now I don't want to fuck this loop up by chopping the snare out because um, it didn't do great things for the loop last time we did that. But I'd love to play with the snare, I'd love to do something different with it. Oh, nice. Whoopsie, forgot we got a mic on. Okay, I mean, uh, 
Arlo Parks would probably do something really deep and beautiful and dark, but that's um, it's not really what I'm very good at, to be honest. So we could take it a little bit crang but let's try and let's try and bear Arlo in the back of our minds because I think she's going to be a useful person to think about. Um, I mean. Uh, Okay, let's just get some samples, some sound in there. Uh, people who watched the third video would have seen this interesting folder I have called Sampled Snippets Random, which really is that. <laughs> Ooh. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Get a little delay on that. Um, oh, I recently got uh, a new plugin again. Uh, for how to today, which I'm really enjoying actually. Not to be uh, reviewing plugins or anything, but it's got a really nice uh, vintage flavor to it um, that I can definitely fuck with. Cool. over here is that gonna be all right I want um okay we're gonna keep all the parks in mind I've got some chords in my head now So annoying, man. Why'd you do this sometimes? Um, okay.
sexy. <laughs> a bit of velocity editing. Um, I kind of believe, well I think and hope that maybe my next good habit to get into is spending more time in the um, because I'm, as you can tell I'm not, I'm not the best player, I'm not terrible. I like it a lot. Cool, cool, cool. Bruh. Um, alright, cool. Sorry, I'm just, uh, I'm just getting out my ciggies. I think it's time. Another two. I turned 25 the other day, I kind of always said, when I turn 25 I'll stop smoking, but here I am, smoking like a fucking mad cunt, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I also said that I would stop swearing so much, when I, cause I'm just too old to be swearing so much, or am I? I'm either not enough of a geezer, or I'm too old to swear as much as I do. You know that experiment where the um, where the, ja the I think it's a Japanese scientist did the thing where he got cubes of ice, and he spoke nice words to one, played at music, uh, so like a cup of ice, sorry, like played at music, spoke nice words to it, gave it compliments, <laughs> and then the other cup of ice, he said like square words and was really mean to it. Apparently, the like crystal helix or whatever of the water changed in one in like a really beautiful way <laughs> and in the other one it turned like really horrible and spiky and nasty so I want to just be looking out for all the cups of ice out there I think we should lo-fi this up a bit. Oh, no, but we don't do that anymore. Good new habits as well. We just go straight to RC20. Because it does make everything better. <laughs> it's a cliche. But it does. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise, guys. Tasty, dusty, vinyl, crackly stuff back in. So let's do that. FX. No. Breaks. Cook and soul bundle. This is the best sample folder I've ever come across. It's really good. Mm. What am I doing? Uh, oh, did I move it? 
It's a joke. Um, Fuego? No, it's in Fuego. No, it's in a hot sauce. Final crackle. There we go. FX. Oh no, we've already fucked with FX. Classics? What's classics? Interested. I'm interested. Oh, I don't know rap enough. Is that actually a sample already? Quite useful though. It does it does make the feels come out a little bit. Just got a little channel strip here. Mm. And it gives you like actual bass because DI bass is great. It is, don't get me wrong. Um, but sounds out bass is just a bit better. Oh, frick, but this latency is gonna bug me out, okay. <laughs>
something like that, something like that. We'll keep it loose. Mm -mm -mm. Yep, 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 yep. Bruh. drums in a bus because we're going to be clean we're going to keep it tidy <laughs> from that ending oh I know what I wanted to do I wanted to get in a little teen a little raid symbol can you see uh, symbols anywhere anybody um, um, I'm, I'm being a muppet Bell. Mm. Ooh, I like that. Oh, do you know what? I did actually get a um a new thing the other day. Sample packs. I'm not totally sold on it yet, if I'm honest. But there is there's lots of rides. Okay. Okay. Yeah, cool. Now I finish my ciggy. Um. Oh, 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 steady. Um. Steady, Freddy. Fine. 
fine. No. Cool. Alright, cool. I think we need a riff of some sorts, you know? It would be nice. Um, I've got my guitar set up. Let me show everybody. So, we got a XLR. It's going to be going from here. Turn the fan. All the way through to the mysterious bedroom. Where we've got a little Blues Junior Fender amp. Um, I think we're going to turn the reverb up. Uh, everything else is kind of in the middle. Um, yeah, we'll keep the fat. Uh, we'll take the fat off actually. Um, and we've got a very lovely AKG 414 mic positioned very loosely in a position that should be okay. Alright. And then oh. we shut both doors, which is the nice bit. Because so we just got straight uh, oh 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 hello. 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 Oh God. Hello. Oh. Okay, we're back. Disc is too slow, right? No, none of that, thank you. Um, Piccola. That's fine.
Okay, just um, oh, it's loud. Just because I'm thinking Arlo Parks is like, yeah, I'm liking it, but that snare makes me sound like um, Madlib or Q-Tip or something in the '90s, and we don't want that. We want to be hitting New Music Friday, so we're gonna go. I think me old Maka Pitsy. Um, has got a nice indie snare, which he tends to use a lot, actually. Um, is it called Mac DeMarco snare? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we can EQ this nicely. Maybe it's too limp. Well, let's find out. <laughs> Okay, we've got three snares going over the top of each other. I know that's not allowed. But we're doing it. I don't care. But it's gonna phase. I don't care, man. Um, okay. How, ooh, how long have we been? Uh, okay, 50 minutes. All right, let's make a little structure and get some vocals in. And then we're good. Um, all right. Um, so, let's start off with something that sounds more like an intro than the rest of this shit. One day we'll do a B section, guys. One day. Gentle crash, gentle crash. There he is. Come on. Gentle, gentle, gentle. as well which has been good I've been really happy with the results is um instrumental bus here we go hello get rid of you um uh low cut frequency we're gonna just make the um, no no not low shelf gain low cut frequency um, so I'll, the beginning of verse one to feel like the beginning of verse one <laughs> Thank you. 
four. Last four, please. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe him up the octave. I don't think it actually is Matt DeMarco's snare. Matt DeMarco, I know you're watching. So don't worry. You don't have to sue me. Um, I think it was that was a little bit more. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Rappers, please jump on this. Please, please. I know that you want to. Someone just going for okay. If you've got a Q-tip self flow, then even better. I want you. I need you. I want you. I need you, baby. I need you. I need your love. Great tune. Um, low cut frequency. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Uh, new movie recording? Yeah. No! Oh god. I don't know, we're good, we're good, we're good. I'm really nervous that one day I'm gonna do one of these and it's not gonna be recording. I think that's a pretty justified things to be nervous about. I'm not very <laughs> observant. Um, okay, let's get these guys. Was it these guys? 
Um, drag them in somewhere. somewhere like Feels like an ending to me. Of some kind, I think, but uh, as usual, nothing's really jumping out on me. That's okay. Um, we're gonna just improvise some shit, and hopefully, something good comes out. Oh, all the time. Oh, oh, do you know what I did do the other day? <laughs> I came up with a good list of objects. Oh god. Please don't look at my notes. Alright, let's just grab some of these objects. Um, uh, waffle maker. <laughs> Laces. Release. Oh, what was the... Oh, Cherish. Hello. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Law enforcement agencies to suspend your national insurance number on an immediate basis, as we have received suspicious trails of information in your name. To know more about the case, press one to get connected to the officer. Thank you. Come on, should do it. <laughs> Brilliant. Hello? Oh no. 
Even my scammers hang up on me these days, guys. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, that's a lyric inspiration. Hold the line. Hold the line. It's a little bit um, Game of Thronesy. Hold the line. Let's out of the way. Ho! All the line. It's a call of the line. Been some time. You can get time when you won't say it up. All the time. It was all the main. It was all the pain. Can't tell if I'm saying to you. All the time. Hold the line, it's a bond night. It's a bond, it's a bond, bond a night. It's a bond a night. It's a bond a night. It's a bond a night. Hold the line, it's a bond a night. It's a bond a night. It's a bond a Okay, cool. Alright, I'm just gonna write gibberish lyrics, okay? Don't judge me. <laughs> this out of the way. Okay, those lyrics are complete bullshit, I promise. My lyrics are normally poetic and deep as a well. Um, but this time they're not, just for once in my life. Um, cool. I reckon I might turn uh, input monitoring off so I don't get latency. Get ready.
cool. We got some stuff there. I think. I think there's some music. All the light. It's all the light. All the light. It's all the light. All the light. It's all the light. There's some time. You can get down when you don't see it. Harmonies. gibberish lyrics you know you just bang them out and often you can find some mean meaning in, in them <laughs> Um, um, okay, this next melody is fully stealing, but uh, it's such a good melody. S W V, um, you're the one. Outro, counter melody. Let's go. Uh, I'm out of breath and I'm feeling dizzy. So
Sisters with, oh god, sisters with voices, that's what they're called. I said I wasn't going to keep the wow, it's pretty lame, pretty trip poppy, pretty lame, but it's fun, isn't it? Come on, we'll keep it. You know what my favorite part of this one is? I think the bass line. I think the bass line's radical. Oh, GoPro's dying. And the GoPro's dead. All right, well, perfect timing. Um, yeah, I think we just bounced that. Sick, well, bye guys. Um, thanks for that, that was fun. Um, uh, and yeah, see you next week. Uh, should I try and get someone next week? Yeah. Try and get someone next week. Um, nice one, guys. Toodaloo. Enjoy your Easter and the end of lockdown. Let's go.